how do the British people say, uh, you, you have to show it in a windy night in Stoke? Something like that. Listen up, people. It's time to pick our team of the year. Rio, you kick us off. He's the best! World Cup winner, gotta be Thomas. I'm not playing FIFA if it's not Thomas Muller. Are you crazy? It's got to be Muller! Yeah, of course. Me, 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 me. Sorry, Manchester. Best defender in the game. They have to buy a roadrunner. Yeah, of course. That's their selections. What are you saying? Who makes your team of the year? <laughs> team of the year Muller. Where's team of the year Muller? Can you vote for him? Oh, you can't? You can't vote for team of the year Muller? The guy who had 26 assists yeah. and 14 goals and won the Champions League and won his league? You can't vote for that? The only thing keeping me happy right now, the only thing keeping me sane right now is the fact that I've got a delicious Dunkin' Donuts order on the way. I've got the breakfast, uh, ham, egg, and cheese uh, bagel on the way. I've got two strawberry frosted donuts and a nice coffee. That's legitimately the only thing keeping me happy because I've been told apparently that Team of the Year Muller is not available to be voted in the Team of the Year, which I have a couple theories about, but let's just get right into it. Well, something boys and welcome to my Team of the Year vote. That is right, the year uh, for the 2019 season. We are going to be voting on my Team of the Year. It just opened up, I believe, about 18. Sorry, no, it wasn't 18 minutes ago. That was the 1 p.m. content drop, which saw us get some new league SBCs, uh, but an hour and 18 minutes ago, we got this Team of the your vote that you can vote for um and we're gonna find out exactly what the vote means this year so you guys already know what it is i know this is a very controversial subject you know you leave one player out you put one player in and then you give a reasoning for wanting one player in because you want to see you want his card in the game but then you vote for another player just because of his in real life performance uh team of the year i'm kind of i, I kind of have mixed opinions about it i mean like it's a video game at the end of the day right so like the actual team of the year vote the way it was voted i think it's pretty accurate i don't know how neuer didn't get into the starting 11 but that's a discussion for another day thomas muller i think needs a whole lot more respect put on his name but uh in terms of fifa i don't think that team of the year we need to take like sure okay we can take it seriously we can be passionate about the players that we love but we don't need to be like crazy about it having to be super super accurate because at the end of the day you know we're voting for players that most of us really just want to see in game you know if you're a barcelona supporter you're voting for probably a good amount of the barca players i mean maybe not in that case if you're, if you're a barca supporter you're probably pretty upset right now but you catch my drift right so liverpool player you're voting for Rabo, taa van dyke uh salah yeah today we're going to get in the team of the year vote I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to be voting in my team of the year. So if you guys think that team of the year Muller should be in team of the year, smash like on the video. If you think that team of the year Muller should be a 90, I don't know, 96, 97 rated SBC card at the drop, I think he should be the 12th man. Smash like on the video if you agree with that. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. So uh, as you guys can see right here, uh, it says be heard, vote now. Choose the best 11 players from the past 12 months of football and submit your vote for the team of the year. So if they're asking us to choose the best players, that pretty much means that we that we should be voting on the best players in real life, right? So about the vote, choose the best 11 players of the last 12 months of football before voting closes on January 18th, right? So we have about 10 days and your vote will count towards the EA Sports FIFA 21 team of the year. The final team of the year will be announced later in January when special team of the year players featuring some of the highest ratings of the season will be released in FUT 21 to celebrate each player's incredible performances. Uh, be heard, vote now. And so here we have a breakdown of all the players that are available here. Wow, that's crazy. All right, boys, so let's get into it. Let's just go ahead and, I suppose, vote for our team of the year. What do you start out with? You start out with, uh, let's start with, I agree. Wait, so hold on. Wait, how do I do this? Okay, so Neuer's over there. Uh, oh, do you drag and drop? Wait, what? Ah, you drag and drop. That's kind of cool. There's there's a little animation. I, listen, I geek out over stuff like that. As someone that loves graphics, I geek out of, uh, over little things like that. Um, I can already see two guys, right? Can, can, I, can I slot Davies? At left center back, that's kind of cool. Ah, I can I can place them anywhere, huh? All right. Um, Matsumos, Jordi Alba, Kimpembe, Laporte, Marquinhos, Rabo, Sergio, uh, Sergio Ramos. Uh, I packed Sergio Ramos in an 82 plus upgrade pack, so I'm inclined to want to throw him in there. Wow, crazy vote uh, for me. Yeah, not Ch Jordi Alba, Jesus Navas, Hernandez, and see, like here, here's the thing, right? Here's the thing, like. I don't know how a Cherubi even did for Lazio. I know they're they're not playing well. So I, I okay. I don't I don't know much about him. Okay, so I don't know uh, about much about a Cherubi season. I know that Amavi Amavi has a headliner card. Uh, TAA Angelino. Like I'm I kind of just want to vote for Teo Hernandez. Yeah, of course. I kind of just want to vote for Hernandez because he's an absolute G. Um, I feel like we have to throw in Sergio Ramos as a defender. 
And then I think we probably need to put some respect on someone else's name. You know what? I think we're going to show a little bit more Bundesliga love. Borussia Mönchengladbach have had a pretty good have had a pretty good season. And yeah, Matthias Ginter is one of my favorite players in the uh, in the national team. They've only conceded one less goal than Bayern. I don't know if that says more about Bayern's issues or uh, Borussia Mönchengladbach's issues, but they've only conceded one less goal than uh, than Bayern. So I mean, I don't know. Yeah, like right, like so. I want Hernandez in there because I want him in the game. Davies, I want him both in the game, and I love Bayern Neuer. Best keeper in the world, in my opinion, right now. Sergio Ramos, you got to put some respect on his name. Again, one of the key reasons that uh, they're having success alongside Kareem Benzema. Um, and, you know, if Benzema and Sergio Ramos were gone, I don't know what happens to Real Madrid. So, like, that's that really just shows how important he is to their team. And then Matias Ginter, you know, like, sure. Could have thrown in Van Dijk, could have thrown in Rabo. As a matter of fact, you want to know what? Maybe I'm going to go back and uh, let's, throw in T let's throw in TAA. You want to know what? We got to show a little bit of Premier League love, okay? So we're going to throw in TAA in there. He's absolutely incredible. I love the guy. Didn't have a good performance in that last match, but, you know, we'll, we'll give him the benefit of the doubt. And we're also judging it off the 2019 season, right? So um, KDB, there's no one else. He's the first guy that you throw into your midfield, right? There's no one else that's even... Um, there's no one else that even comes close. Hendo, uh, Joshua Kimmich, of course, he's going to go in there as well. So, so far, we've got three Bayern boys. Uh, we're doing pretty good with the ratio there. Kovacic, uh, Cruz, Luis Alberto. Like, what is, like, okay, so I don't know if Thomas Muller would be submitted as a midfielder or an attacker, but if he is a midfielder, the fact that you can vote for Lars Stindl, and I know I was just talking about Borussia Mönchengladbach, and of course, they've been really, really good, but that's absolutely insane. I'm going to tell you who I'm going to vote for here. And I think you guys already know who it is. Who it is. I want to vote for Tony Cruz, but we've shown a good amount of German uh, uh, a good amount of German support already. And I want to throw Papu Gomez in there as well. And we have Fernangs, but I think we've represented the, the, the Premier League enough there. What I think I'm going to do, boys, <laughs> is go with another Premier League player. I'm going to throw in... Uh, I'm going to throw in Hyung Min Son. Hyung Min Son, obviously, super, super important for Spurs. Uh, so we're going to throw him in there. Son, Kimmich, uh, KDB. Obviously, have to have KDB there. Have to have Kimmich in there, in my opinion. The two best midfielders in uh, in the league. But um, it, two of the best midfielders in the world. But Youngman Son, just because he's interesting, and I do want a Team of the Year Youngman Son card, I think he's got to get in. How How is Jozalu in this Team of the Year voting, and and and, and Thomas Muller's not? Harry Kane, Lewandowski. As Muller would say, Lewandowski. And you want to know what? I hate this pressure that I'm feeling. That I have to put in Messi. Where's Ronaldo? Where's Ronaldo? Wait, is... Am I missing something here? Yeah, there's Cristiano Ronaldo. I hate this kind of pressure that I'm feeling. That if I don't put in Ronaldo or Messi, I'm upsetting one of the two sides, right? So, like, if I take out Messi and put in someone that I really want to put in, like, Haaland, uh, Erling, or... Or Karim Benzema, man. Lewandowski has to get in because he's he was the best player in Europe uh, in 2019. Messi had the most goals of any player. Sure, Barcelona finished second, but he was a big reason why they even finished second, why they were even in contention because of such a tumultuous year that they have, all right? So, um, Messi, 25 goals. Um, assists, Messi, 21 assists. So, Messi has to get in. 25 goals, 21 assists, okay? Kareem Benzema, 21 goals for uh, Real Madrid. And then, uh, the reason I'll say that is... Real Madrid only conceded 25 goals, which is two less than Atletico Madrid, and we know how we know how incredible they are uh, defensively. So, I, the reason that I'm not going to give it to Benzema, and even though I do, I feel like Benzema, Thomas Muller deserves to be the 12th man 100%. But if if there, if there's if he's not the 12th man, then I think a Kareem Benzema deserves to be it, and that's the only reason that I'm not going to give it to Kareem. That's why I'm going to give it to Messi over or Kareem Benzema, just because Messi meant so much more to Barcelona. And of course, Kareem Benzema means a whole lot to Real Madrid, but Real Madrid has guys like Tony Cruz and then also a Sergio Ramos, right? Doing absolute bits for them. So I'm going to put a little bit of respect on uh, on Messi's name. Of course I will. And that's why we're going to include him in Team of the Year. That's why we're going to throw him into the Team of the Year. And then Ronaldo won the league and he was the top goal scorer. He was the second. Was he the second or the top goal scorer? He was the... Second top goal scorer after Chiro Immobile, who had 36. I mean, like, Chiro Immobile deserves to have some respect put on his name, right? Lazio finished fourth. Um, but a big part of why they finished fourth was because of uh, the performance of Chiro Immobile, who deserves a little bit of respect as well. So, And then Papu Gomez is in there with 16 assists. 
Um, you know, Atalanta did bits as well. Third third place. So I don't know, man. I I got it. You have to include Ronaldo and Messi. That that's why that that's why Ronaldo and Messi are the way that they are. And then Lewandowski. There's I wish there were more slots, but we only have 11 players that we can put in here. So I don't know. I think that's gonna have to be my. Uh, I think that's gonna have to be my team of the year. We show a little bit of Premier League love. You know, we, we show some love to the Liverpool supporters because, of course, they deserve it. Trent Alexander-Arnold was amazing. KDB, arguably, arguably the best midfielder in Europe. Um, a lot, I know the Manchester United supporters are going to come for me, but at least, you know, be happy that I voted for Cristiano Ronaldo, showing a little bit of ex-Manchester United love. Top three, there's no debate. This is so easy to do. I mean, like Chiro Mobile, Benzema, those are the two guys that I could think about possibly having in there. I don't, I don't, I feel like sometimes we take team of the year voting too seriously. And there's a lot of guys that I think deserve to be in here, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to submit my vote. Um, yeah, we're going to download the image and uh, that's going to be my team of the year vote, boys. That's going to do it for the vote, boys. And the most important thing and one of the most interesting questions that I have for you guys is let me know what you think about my vote. Let me know what you think about your vote. Let me know who's uh, a player that maybe people aren't uh, giving enough uh, giving enough credit to. Um, let me know in the comment section below. And I feel very good that I have four Bayern players. I could have gone crazier with this, but I, I think four players is, uh, is adequate to show the impact that they had on that season where they won their league, they won the Champions League, um, and just an incredible, incredible performance from the boys. And we need a 12th man, Thomas Muller, a plea. Please, for the love of God, 96 rated minimum. But that's going to do it for the episode. Yeah. Smash like if you guys did enjoy. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. I will catch you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, my bros. Going to catch you guys for a rewards, reward stream later tonight on, on this Twitch stream. Link will be in the description below. Catch you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, juice Later. Update.